Hey, good afternoon. Welcome back. You see our storm tracker showing the scattered showers, thunderstorms that are moving through the Wabash Valley right now. You can see this line of rain right along I-70 here, providing moderate rainfall. You're doing any driving back and forth between Indiana, Illinois, or going up to Indy over the next couple of hours here. You're going to be driving through rain because you can see uh, another round is on the way. This one a little bit stronger. It is producing some lightning, some thunder. You see that darker red color. That's that heavier rain. And again, this is going to swing through here providing us with the same heavy rain, rumbles of thunder, uh, flashes of lightning, and you can see our temperatures at this moment, lower 50s, upper 40s, despite the fact that you're going to be dealing with rain. Now you saw in the storm tracker there, it's going to swing through here, but our temperatures are going to continue to rise and we're going to see warmer conditions actually as we move through the rest of the night and early morning tomorrow than we're even seeing now. And you can see our future cast showing the scattered rain showers. So we get through here, one to two, two to three, three to four, the rain showers exit. We have mostly cloudy skies at this point, but I wouldn't rule out staying behind as we move through the middle part of the afternoon, late afternoon. Some light drizzle, a mist situation where even though the rain's not strong enough to really uh, appear impressive on the future cast, uh, you're dealing with some light sprinkles that you're dealing with, uh, you know, maybe some annoying rain. Now, this is around five over the course of the night tonight. You can see where this is around 11 more of what I'm talking about here, but it starts to gain some strength and continue right along the same lines as we move through the day tomorrow. So this is seven tomorrow morning and remember it's warming up this whole time. So you have scattered showers, thunder showers that swings through here, almost the exact same area right along I-70 and to the north, uh, some light rain farther to the south, and this starts to dip its way to the southeast with even more rain continuing as we move through these next several days. Like I said, we're stuck in that rainy pattern here where our temperatures are increasing each day, but we are still dealing with a threat of rain. We're in the upper 50s this afternoon and look at our lows tonight. Our lows uh, temperatures right where they are uh, upper 50s. We're going to see temperatures rise to the upper 50s today, but it's going to happen much later than when it typically does. You know, warmest part of the day is usually 3 4 p.m. It's going to happen closer to 6 7 p.m. this evening, and then it's going to continue to get warmer as we move through the overnight with temperatures in the lower 60s tomorrow morning, upper 60s tomorrow afternoon with showers, thunder showers possible once again. And our 7 day forecast shows we're not really going to see a cool down until we get started with the weekend.